Hello. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing good. Good. My name is Mr. Dabalina. I'm calling from the U.S. Census Bureau. Uh, just 30 seconds here. Do you think broccoli would be more appealing to children if it wasn't green? Yes. And have you ever eaten a crayon? No. Uh, why do we kill people for killing people to show that killing is wrong? Uh, I think there's something wrong with their mind. And how do you throw away a garbage can? In the recycle. I'm sure they have bins for that. And can you see Russia from your house? I'm from Alaska, but no, I can't. <laughs> All right. On a scale of 1 to 10, what comes after 10? 11. And last question, because I could tell you're really busy. Uh, do you ever wear socks that don't match? Uh, yes, a couple of times. <laughs> Is it stealing if you eat a grape at the supermarket before you pay for them? I think so. And any idea where the name Thong came from? Uh, China. <laughs> and do you think that the chicken used in Kentucky Fried Chicken Meals really comes from Kentucky? No. And how low can you go? At my age, about halfway down. And do you think that the person who named the BlackBerry phone is a racist? Uh, I think so. All right. And why is the most expensive cheese always the smelliest? Because they age it the longest. And do you like to start off all wedding toasts with, your collective blood will soak the fields where I harvest with revenge? I have never done that before. All right. Well, you can use it if you want. It's not mine exclusively. And are you still peeing green from St. Patrick's Day? No. Do you ever fist pump after finishing in the bathroom? No. And how often you... only five questions. What, what are you doing? Oh, I'm sorry. I meant five pages of questions. Oh, for God's sake. Well, we're just on the last page here. Two questions left. Uh, do you think the number one reason married men die before their wives is because they want to? No, they're just unhealthier. And is it true that nothing tips like a cow? No. You ever uh, milk a Red Bull? No. No, because it'd be a male. It wouldn't give off milk. Uh, oh. Would you ever slaughter a goat if it would lead to a more fulfilling sex life? No. And uh, do you think it'd be fun to be Amish for the weekend? Yes. And if a woman has a camel toe, does that mean she needs a pedicure or a new pair of pants? My favorite is when they have a hard time doing that. I, I'm, I'm hanging up on you as soon as possible.